Hello, good morning, beautiful world. Uh, this is a Ferris uh, Hajri PhD AM uh, from Oman, Sultanate of Oman. Uh, we are in Virginia uh, to conduct clinical research study and to prove the effectiveness of Hakwa revitalized therapy. This particular session we cover about uh, the aging process with regards to Hakwa revitalized therapy. Which actually, it's known that hydrate means making the body absorbing water or liquid. Whereas we came recently to coin with the word Hakwet. So Hakwet means making the body absorbing Hakwa and Hakwa denotes to hot aqua and hot aqua as like simply known as hot water and so hakuating is to make the body absorbing water oxygen hydrogen energy and all these four natural elements are simply found through one source water at a specific temperature for consumption use means for drinking so abiding the aquapetic methods of aqua gulping and when you say gulping is different from sipping and different from drinking gulping is you fill your mouth and swallow but sipping is to take just this very small quantity to your mouth and drinking is just drinking uh, one gulp like drinking cold water or juice at one gulp or uh, but gulping is taking a specific amount fill your mouth you can tolerate the temperature which is 50 degrees celsius or 122 degrees fahrenheit well so uh aging process and aqua revitalized therapy albert z george the hungarian biochemist he discovered that human body stores hydrogen pools in his organs and the largest is stored in the liver and so on followed by other organs the spleen the heart uh, the the kidneys and all these but the least is stored in the spleen and he found that that the aging process is due to oxidation of the cells so free radicals occur when a cell is being oxidized now when an adult is composed a human adult is composed of 100 trillion cells and every single day between 50 to 70 billion cells die apoptosis that's called and the new cells compensate the dead cells in the same number so the cell cycle is completed by replacing the dead cells when new cells come up reproduce so that's it completely so when the human get sick infection so more cells are oxidized and with the aging process as we grow older the number of cells that reproduce do not compensate the cells that are dead so we have less number of cells produced and more cells that are dead so when human life stop completely it's the time actually cells productivity completely stop well we believe that human has the capability to cross the golden age and when we talk about the golden age we talk about 50 years old and the productivity of the brain increase when you reach by the age of 50 so when you're an age of 50 that's the time based on your experience life experience you've gained for the last 50 years you have gained a lot of knowledge and ready to serve the society the generations to the field that you became expert on that on that irrespective of what the field whatever so uh, what that age that's the time to start to give knowledge to society to share the knowledge your expertise you're already an expert you're professional in your field well 
But what we see today is different. People they reach the 50s old, 55, 60, and so on. They proclaim as old, but old is gold. So because of the aging process, the signs of the aging like uh, wrinkles, weak immune system, weak bones, arthritis and uh, lumbago and other complications and uh, other sickness, ailments and so on. So uh, the person becomes so weak for one reason. We found that it's related because to when a human is created in the womb of his mother during the fetal development, actually the action takes place naturally without interference of any human being by itself. The baby, when it grows inside the womb of his mother, is encountered with amniotic fluid, which is simply hot water. 99% water by percentage, only 1%, so tiny, is a protein, collagen, non-collagen, which is a, for the baby, protein for the baby. And the temperature is 37.5 degrees Celsius, which is one degree higher than the normal mother's temperature at the normal, uh, normal time. So it's hot and it's water, so it's hot water. So it's the source of creation of and growth of every human being. From there actually, the source, actually hot water is the source of the four essential elements of life as we coined them, the fields, F-E-E-L apostrophe S, the fields, four essential elements of life are water, oxygen, hydrogen, energy, so simple. Now. When human go back to the therapeutic methods of drinking hot water or therapeutic methods of uh, aqua gulping drinking hot water specifically for adults with a specific temperature with a specific amount specific program and for children even from newly born baby until the time of maturity there is a specific temperature for the babies children and amount as well uh, per day then we can maintain these fuels in our body and as we grow older we maintain our young looking we maintain our entire holistic health physical emotional mental and spiritual and we can avoid the all these signs of the aging by avoiding all these radical cells the damage that happen with the cells and uh, as Albert St. George found that hydrogen donates a, an electron that has been oxidized and become a impair because as an adult is made up, is composed of 100 trillion cells and each cell is composed of 100 trillion atoms and inside the atom we have a pair of electron and proton but the pro, uh, proton electrons and the neutrons but the neutrons are neutral they have no any role so the protons and electrons, so when, like on ex oxygen, is composed of, made up of uh, eight electrons and eight protons, pair. So when it becomes oxidized, oxidation of the cell is like you take a steel outside, exposed to the air, and then it gets rusted, become oxidized. So the cells go through oxidation, as we mentioned, because of sickness, infection, and aging, and also metabolism. The food we eat goes being processed by the enzyme, broken down to produce energy for the cells as well as uh, from the amino acid to produce, uh, to build up the cells and produce energy. So there's a, another section about this explaining. So when the food goes through, when you go through metabolic system, the waste that reproduce, of course, they infect the cells and causing the oxidation of the cells. So we can we can avoid, we can prevent oxidation of the cells. We can maintain our healthy look and by maintaining the fuels, the hydrogen, oxygen, water, and energy in our body by simply maintaining how revitalized therapy, drinking method, which is a consumption method, and other modalities like uh, the steam method, the compressed method, the hot air method after the compressed method, and so on. So we wish you a wonderful life and healthy life and we believe that very soon 
hospitals will turn to resorts. Like as this place is called the Stonewall Resort and it got a jacuzzi there that's hot water and it's beautiful. So they have a jacuzzi outside, jacuzzi inside. Uh, many resorts today, people are going to relax and they enjoy the hot jacuzzi, the hot water. It's for external use, hot spring and so on. And so that is for external use. Then you have for internal use is drinking method and you have the compressed method and you have other modalities of aqua revitalized therapy. Thank you so much and we wish you a wonderful day and uh, we wish you a healthy life and that you grow by age but you remain young looking. Today we are celebrating three days back. Uh, I just celebrated my 56th birthday. I'm 56 years old. And I believe that as I grow, I remain young, physical, emotional, mental, and spiritual, including you who follow and everyone who follow this uh, simple method, cheap, available to everyone. It's non-toxic and we need it for every day in our life. Just change the temperature without additive. There, make a big change to your life. Have a wonderful day. Take care. Bye-bye.